Unit uh, 22, question 71. So consider the following equation, uh, metabolic heat production, positive, uh, conductive and convective heat exchange. Uh, conductive means um, heat exchange when things are touching. Convective means that there is an air current where uh, things are hot at the bottom and then rise to the top and then the cool air at the top comes back down and so there's a movement of air and, and uh, there's an exchange of heat that way. And then uh, net radiation um, heat exchange. Believe it or not, uh, you know, humans and uh, mammals do have radiation, uh, cooling uh, by radiation from uh, blood that will flow to the skin. And uh, there is some of that that happens. But of course, evaporative heat loss uh, is most important for us. Uh, that's sweating <laughs> and, uh, you know, when it, when it is required. Anyway, to the question, 71. Which of the following responses uh, could um, the body make to decrease the body temperature? of a person in a hot Turkish bath where the ambient temperature is 40 degrees Celsius and the air is fully saturated. Yeah, definitely underlined fully saturated. Obviously, that's very important because, um, you know, sweat must evaporate. That's how it cools the skin, you know, so it has to evaporate. But if the air is saturated, so it's full, you know, with fluid already because of the humidity of a Turkish bath or, or whatever, then, then that will not permit uh, heat loss uh, through uh, evaporation. Uh, that's something you, you, have, you would have to keep in mind. So 71A, it says uh, increasing HE, which is, which is um, the evaporative uh, heat loss, which is uh, not going to happen in, if the air is fully saturated. I mean, that's, those are their words. So increasing HC. Uh, so HC is the conductive and convective um, uh, heat exchange. That's not good. <laughs> That's not good because your body temperature is about 37 degrees. Okay, and so if this is an environment that is 40 degrees, you don't want any conductive or um, uh, uh, convective heat exchange with the environment because all that means is the environment will make you hotter and hotter and that's not what you want you want to cool down when you're in that kind of environment so B would be a bad thing and increasing H total is the metabolic heat production you definitely don't want to increase your heat production when you are in a Turkish bath you want to find ways to cool off um, when the environment is hotter than you so then um, the the answer would be D none of the above and, uh, and I recommend you don't stay in that bath for more than 20 minutes and you hydrate yourself as much as you can and uh, to uh, read about uh, some of the things the skin does um, uh, to um, take care of itself, <laughs> which is our body's largest organ, is uh, you can read in bio 13.3.